hip hop, hip hop, yeah. hip hop, hip hop, bars is back, hip hop, Sam hip and hop, oh god. Pop uncensored is the vibe, so subscribe. Oh god, driving Sam and riding passenger side. She's a little, I see her as my daughter. Mm -hmm. Nigga shot my daughter in my foot, nigga. Oh no. Mm -hmm. And I got gout too. I know how that feel. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Wow, man. Definitely, definitely. Um, Cat Williams. What's your memories of Cat, man? Talk about Cat a little bit. Uh, man, I wish, you know. I don't know, man. You know, like I said, I don't really got no beef with the nigga. The nigga owed me some money. He pulled the gun on me with no bullets. Damn. Then he called Suge Knight, and he forgot me and Suge Knight good. Like, damn, these niggas know each other. Yeah, nigga. It's blood! <laughs> <laughs> so, I, I, you know, at, at this time... I, I kind of wish niggas just don't have a, a happy life, man. Cat's, cat, the real Cat Williams, I forgot his real name, is a is a is a is a is a beautiful brother. But then when he puts on his costume, his Dave East costume, <laughs> then it becomes a show. It's like ah. But no, nigga, I'm really from this cough, nigga. I don't walk around with fucking security blood. You see me with some security, nigga? I really, I can go to these hoods by myself. I do it. But that's what they don't understand. It's a real cold out here. So he don't really know the code and he trying to get into the gangster shit and be a comedian. No, nigga, we comedians. We make people laugh. We make people better. So I want him to get back to that, man, because um, the real Cat Williams, I love. I'm going to tell you that much. He's a good he's a good nigga, but when he put on the Dave East, you know, Corn East suit. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Dang. Corn East. <laughs> What's wrong with Dave? Huh? What's wrong with that? You don't like Davies? Come on, man. That corny ass fake crip nigga. I'll be like, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Mm. What the fuck? Mm. See, we don't know enough to say enough. I don't know. We privy to talk about that. We don't know enough information. I was so surprised that MC8 gave him a stamp. Hmm. I know MC8 is official. So he gave him a stamp. I don't know if that's about the music business, but I don't know. But the song he did with Davies was, was whack. MC8 got a song called Honcho, That Motherfucker Blazing. You don't fuck with Davies as a rapper either? I think, I think he's a dope rapper. You don't, think you don't like him? Get the fuck out of here. How you going to... Damn. I would fuck with him if he didn't make up this whole fake ass corny. He was the crip, and now he a crip, and he was in jail. And I get it was like, how you come out of the record? How you come out of jail with a record deal? Hmm. Hmm. Would you sleeping on your stomach in jail, nigga? Hmm. Oh man, damn. I ain't see East like that. I mean, I never thought about it. I saw him while I'm running around with Nipsey a little bit. You know, um, it wasn't, I mean, come on, that nigga's a fan of because Nipsey, everybody loved Nip, man. Yeah, Nip's a real Nip nigga, cut from him. Everybody, come on, man. You see what kind of Nick Nipsey gonna attract all kind of motherfuckers because he got he got real light. Right. You see what I'm saying? And that was detrimental to, to him. He tried, you know what I'm saying? Every he wasn't guarded, he wasn't with no nigga, he was a real nigga, a street cat. So that's how niggas get out for real. So yeah, Corn East gonna get up next to him. It wasn't like, you know, he's like, hey, you know, yeah. It, it, Nipsey was a positive black young brother. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He, he saw through Dave Corn East, like, oh, I see you trying to, okay, I see. 
Yeah, you a crip. <laughs> Where you from? Hamptons? <laughs> Hampton Crips? Sagan Paul Crips? What the fuck, nigga? Knock it off. If you want to commit suicide, I mean genocide, just commit gen genocide, nigga. Uh. Corn East. Yeah, I know, man. I know. But that's their culture. That's why I'm not mad at 6 9 because that's they they all 6 9 Damn. They all 6 9 man. Goofy Blood started it. Um, Sean Cottery or John Jay Z. <laughs> this is their shit. So I, I stay out of it and go, oh, I'm not going. I have some. Some, some, uh, history with criminal activity. How about that? So, and anybody can look at my shit on blood. Uh, <laughs> you can look at my shit. How do you feel about, um, Rock Nation CEO Desiree Perez? I, I, I don't know who she is. I heard she was a... It, it makes sense. It makes sense. She Jay -Z sold 92 birds and fell back. And the police backed him. I don't know what... The, I, I don't know who she is. I know, you know, I, I, I know very little of her. I know um, the the police, the other police nigga, 6 9 exposed her, but I don't know who she is. I don't know... Only nigga I know at uh, Rock Nation is uh, Jay Moore, Jay Brown. I've been knowing this nigga for years. Since in LA, he was a cool brother. That's the only nigga I know. I've been knowing him for years. Before okay. he was with over there. Got you. What do you think about the Vlad TV revolution? A lot of people are all Vlad TV saying we got to get paid. Um, we, 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 we kind of get they fucking with me. I know more. Vlad, so now, yeah, that's a hard one right there, blood. You, you. You can't fuck with the minister, man. He's like that. It's like Bill Cosby and the minister. We got Bill, Bill. They took Bill Cosby out. We got the minister left. He can't. He ain't going nowhere. Mm -hmm. So I asked Vlad to explain it to me. He said it was a, a mistake or it was misquoted or I don't know. I mean, you know. You, you you can't I'm you, you you can't if he dissed the minister you you cannot be alongside that 